We have some big news to talk about in the cryptocurrency market for Pepe today because we have a big Binance alert to talk about. What does this actually mean, this big Binance news about the long-term price of Pepe? We're gonna be talking about that question in this video. I also wanna to touch on the rest of the crypto market because again, there is volatility in the crypto market. What does it mean for the Pepe price long-term? And some other very important updates you guys should be aware of in the crypto market if you hold any type of crypto. So very important update in today's video if you guys enjoy it smash the thumbs up button and let's get into it the first piece of news i actually want to tell you guys is uh, have a look at this so we do have some bullish long-term signals happening for pepe even though in the crypto market today look let's be honest it is volatile there's a lot of cryptos retracing actually i'll explain why that's happening in this video but what is this long-term bullish sign so we have a whale and they've actually withdrawn a cool 14.7 million dollars worth of pepe from the binance cryptocurrency exchange and you guys know binance it's the home of many many whales out there and this is a large outflow and generally you know if you want to understand crypto it is a bullish sign when they do withdraw their crypto from a centralized exchange like Binance. So sometimes it can be bearish if you see whales send their crypto, their Pepe to a centralized exchange because most likely, you know, they're potentially looking to trade and then off ramp it back to fiat. In this example, you know, the whale is most likely putting their cryptocurrency, their Pepe on a cold storage device, which generally speaking, you know, it's the safest long-term place to uh, store your Pepe Okay. Uh, right there so that is definitely looking exciting for Pepe and uh, you know there's a lot of speculation why they've been doing it but you know there are big whales out there there are big investors that you know do potentially see Pepe as a very nice long-term cryptocurrency so not just a short-term crypto and uh, look there is volatility in the crypto market today but you have to be thinking long term if you actually do take a look at the Pepe price and I actually have a very long-term uh, graph right here you know you guys who have been on this channel with me uh, over this journey you're going to know that uh during this patch if you have a look right here you know this is a long period of you know basically sideways trading in the crypto market but those people who are patient with the long-term vision they're the ones who got this massive reward in uh, this section but having said that I still think Pepe will be in a great position with the upcoming bull cycle once it hits properly in the cryptocurrency market right now. Because if we actually do take a look at the crypto bubbles today, you can see pretty much every single crypto across the board, it's gonna be down in price. And why is this happening? And the reason it is, it's because of Bitcoin. So Bitcoin is really struggling at the moment to really break out of this zone. So we have been speaking about this on the channel right here. I have been telling you guys about this box and this just seems to be a lot of battles happening uh, within here. So I call this the battle box at the moment uh, we are in. And uh, Bitcoin is really, you know, we want to see Bitcoin break out of this to the upside at the moment. You know, it does seem like some days it is testing to break out, but then it kind of retraces. So there is a lot of mixed flows of money happening with Bitcoin. Some ETF people are loading up on more Bitcoin. Then you have whales are selling off on Bitcoin as well. And we have seen, you know, somewhat, you know, troublesome news in the short term. And you can see right here, German government transfers another 52 million in Bitcoin, threatening more Bitcoin selling pressure. So anytime you see these governments and uh, look, they're looking to sell potentially Bitcoin on the market, of course, it can put downwards pressure in the short term. That then rattles into the crypto bubbles. All the cryptos take a bit of a dip, uh, but it is the long term which you have to look out for. So they're not going to be selling you know forever you know that downwards pressure will dissipate i would think in the cryptocurrency market and uh you know there are battles as well between whales going long and short in the cryptocurrency market as well right there and also into the meme coins so you know long term i'm i'm feeling quite bullish on pepe over the long term but have a look out for this as well so if you are someone who actively hunts down new meme coins we check them out all the time on the channel have a look at this news as well sydney sweeney's x account hacked to promote crypto meme coin that apparently didn't do too well right there but uh just watch out over on x x is a hub of alpha but you have to always remember and whether this was a hack or not a hack you just have to remember it is going to be very very volatile uh especially new meme coins in the cryptocurrency market so apparently her x account was hacked and uh she did promote a crypto and there are a lot of celebrity meme coins getting launched uh into the crypto market as well so watch out for them very very volatile but just something to be aware of uh, in the crypto market and hacks can happen all the time and mario says right here will meme coin 
coins dominate the next alt season and uh, I do think there is good potential meme coins will dominate the next alt season. So at the moment, 2023, 2024, no joke guys, meme coins have literally dominated the crypto market even though there is a little bit of short term volatility. Uh, meme coins, number one sector in crypto 2023, number one sector in crypto 2024, but there's always going to be shifting areas of crypto. So you can go into meme coins, there's also going to be high utility cryptos as well, uh, but it's definitely an exciting area to watch out for. And you can see on the crypto market today, mini retracements a lot, lot across mini meme coins. Pepe down 6.3% right here. But I do think, you know, over the long term, uh, you know, once we do get bullish catalysts coming into, you know, Bitcoin, Pepe, and what these could potentially be as well. So when you think about catalysts, uh, for both Pepe and uh, the Bitcoin price. I think Pepe, you know, one thing could be a Coinbase uh, listing. That would be very bullish. Another thing to watch out for, and I do think this is going to play a big role, guys, 2024, 2025 uh, US presidential race. So I reckon we're probably going to get news. Biden's going to drop out of the race soon. It might be replaced by another Democrat. So watch out for that. And uh, from that, you have to think about, you know, crypto policy as well, because you want to attract more money into the USA for crypto. You want companies building in the USA and I do think that's going to increase the capital inflows into crypto. Also, we want those uh, big ETF providers, the institutional managers to be buying up Bitcoin on the ETFs and uh, basically dollar cost averaging into Bitcoin. We want to see that as well. And uh, also the global economy as well. So the global economy can get uh, more stable because there's still a lot of uncertainty, you know, inflation, housing pressures, cost of living crises. And that, if that stuff gets resolved, right, people are going to have more money to invest into crypto and uh, cryptos like Pepe as well. And that definitely could uh, push up the Pepe price right there. So over the long term, even though the crypto market volatile today, you know, watch out for that. It'd be great to see Pepe. I think over the long term, if we get to 50 billion, that would be fantastic. I'd love to see that. And guys, comment down below what kind of price prediction market capitalization would you be most happy with for Pepe the crypto? Very interested to hear your thoughts, but drop a prediction down below where you want it to go to. Would you be happy with 50 billion? Do you want to see 1 billion? Or do you think Pepe they could really, you know, challenge the roost and the roof of uh, the crypto market and uh, potentially could hit one trillion one day. Interested to hear your thoughts. You can see right here, Bitcoin is sitting at 1.2 trillion. And uh, to be honest with you guys, this is all built by community that believe in Bitcoin's value. That's literally the driving price of our Bitcoin. And that definitely can translate into the market caps of many meme coins out there. But guys, that is a big uh, update in the crypto market. I do think uh, the future does look bright for Pepe. Shout out to our Plasma for this nice meme, nice artwork right there. And uh, if you guys enjoy the Pepe updates, subscribe to the channel, hit the notification bell so you get more. If you want to see other types of updates as well, let me know in the comment section below. We could do crypto news. We can do, you know, any type of crypto really in the crypto market. There's no area within crypto beyond our reach in the crypto market right here on the channel. But guys, really appreciate you uh, watching this video. I hope you have a good day and I'll see you guys in the next video. Crypto Zeus signing out.